Hey Libra, welcome back to the channel. My name is Nali, aka Awotero, and I am here to give you guys your daily message. We're going to tap into this energy, see what is going on with you guys for today. But before we get started, if you are new to the channel, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Click that notification bell so you can be notified when I post a new reading. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for all your love and support. I appreciate every single one of you guys. Libra, as you all know, these readings are for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. These are timeless general love readings, so they may or may not resonate with you. Please take what does, leave the rest behind. Time is fluid, guys, so whenever you find this reading, you are meant to hear it. And there is no gender in tarot. Reverse the roles as need be. Cross watchers, you're always welcome. Guys, don't forget to check your other placements so you get a better understanding of this energy. And if you want to book a personal reading, the info is in the description box below. Let's go ahead and get started here. Let's see what is going on. Universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians, what is the message for Libra for today? Queen of Wands in the reverse. Queen of Swords in the upright and the King of Pentacles. All right, guys. There was definitely a third-party situation here. And Three of Pentacles in the reverse. You found out about a third-party situation. And you decided to walk away from the current connection you're in. With the Three of Pentacles here in the reverse. You found out that there was somebody else in this connection. And again, again, guys, keep in mind, third-party situations don't always have to do with a sexual connection. It can be friends, family, cousin, sister, brother, grandma, grandpa, mom, dad, whoever that is interfering in this connection. And you got tired of it. So what did you do? You decided to stop putting the work into this connection. You could be this queen, queen of swords because you are definitely speaking the truth here, okay? And you are dealing with an earth sign. This earth sign allows other people into this connection and it isn't cool. And you don't like it. And you're deciding to not put the work in the connection anymore. What else, universe? Ten of cups. Damn, are you walking away? Like, are you leaving home for real? Or are you asking somebody to leave home? Because there's an ending here. There's a broken home here, okay? This is an emotional ending. I feel that for some of you guys, you decided this weekend to end whatever's going on with this person because they're allowing too many people in your connection and you're not going to be able to work with them like that if everybody else has opinions. With the world here in the reverse, you feel like this is a this is a cycle that has yet to be closed. This person allows a lot of people in the connection and that isn't cool because they don't even listen to you. They don't acknowledge what you're really thinking or feeling, okay? So you've decided to just pull away already. For some of you guys, you actually decided to move out of the house. For other you guys, you asked them to leave. But at the end of the day, somebody's leaving. Knight of Wands, and you, someone is leaving like a bat out of hell here. You're passionate. You you believe in what you want, and you're moving forward. You're not gonna. You're not okay. My thing is this: you're not gonna allow anyone else in your in your personal in your personal circle when it comes to you and your your spouse or your boyfriend or your girlfriend. You're not gonna allow that. You're not gonna allow that. And you've decided to move on from this already. You've decided to close out. At least for the time being, you don't want to deal with this no more. Ace of Swords. But as you decide to walk away, as you give this person a piece of your mind, guess what? They're coming back towards you with some type of truth. With some type of clarity. With some type of conversation that may open up the door here to a new beginning again. I feel that your person is going to suck it up and go tell their mom... Ma, you need to stay out of my business. Sis, you need to stay out of, out of my business. If they were dealing with a physical third-party situation, they'll be like, bitch, you're dead and gone. I don't want to be with you. Okay? This person is making clear and concise decisions. Why? Because they want to come back towards you for a new beginning. They do not want you to walk away with the Eight of Cups. They do not want you to leave. They're looking at you leave right now, and they want to hold you back as much as they can, but they know that they can't because they have to speak a truth. They have to X, X out all the people that don't serve your guys' connection. Seven of Cups. This person is no longer confused. They know what they want, and they want you in their future. They want you in their future. This person wants to manifest this return. This person wants the opportunity to be able to grow with you. This person wants to manifest the happiness. This person sees you like this. This is you. Sexy, vibrant. You have so much power over this person, and I don't feel that this person can bear to do life without you. Five of Pentacles. 
you have left this connection out in the cold. Eight of Pentacles. You have decided to work on yourself because of the Ten of Swords. This person put you through so much shit. You have decided to move towards your own stable new beginning. Okay? And this person with the Six of Swords is going to stop you like no one's business. Okay? Because this is you getting in that car, packing that shit up, and getting ready to move. And they're going to stand right in front of the car. You're going to be like, oh, what does this motherfucker want? That's going to be you. But this person is going to tell you. I will fix this. I want to fix this. Please give me an opportunity to fix this. I want a chance to be able to fix this. Some of you guys may be like, okay, you go ahead and fix this and bring me the receipts and let me know if you fixed it or not. Because I'm still leaving. Some of you guys will not stay. You are definitely, you've already packed up that car. You are not carrying shit back in the house. Okay? You will not come back until this person proves to you that they've removed these third parties out of your life. They want reconciliation. They see you as a soulmate. They see you as this queen of pentacles. You have a lot of love for them. They have a lot of love for you. This person's coming towards you with apologies. This person wants a future with you. This person no longer wants to fight with you. This person wants a reconciliation here. Reconciliation, okay? They want to be able to come back together with you. With the Wheel of Fortune, there's going to be things changing and disconnection. And honestly, I feel that your person's going to tell these people flat out, I can't have these third-party energies in my life. I can't deal with you guys coming in and breaking <clears throat> breaking my marriage or my relationship apart. Your opinions don't matter anymore. I have to move forward. Why? Because I am in love with this person with the Queen of Cups. And they're going to come towards you. They're going to apologize. And here you go. Wish fulfillment. This person's going to give you your place. Okay? This person's going to make sure that they put everybody else in their place and they're going to make sure to let them know that you are the one that's going to run the show now. This person is no longer stuck. You guys are currently in separation, okay? But they want a reconciliation and they're going to come towards you very passionately for a new beginning here. They want victory with you and they're going to tell you, they're going to speak their truth and they're going to tell you flat out, I don't want to lose you and I don't want to give up on this connection because without you, this is me. In this nine of swords energy i will go crazy i will go crazy without you this is exactly what they're going to tell you this person is going to take a leap of faith with you or towards you to make amends to recover the situation to have reconciliation so they can have that happy life with you okay now let's go ahead and get you some messages here so we could close out your reading what is the overall message for libra universe overall message far apart I'm telling you, some of you guys decided to really, like, drive away. You're not going to come back until this person gets everything cleared up. I'm not going to take those. They're on the floor. What else, universe? What else do we have here? And take a deep breath. Meditation, healing, rest. Take this time to meditate and rest. You're being asked to take your time right now so you can manifest what you truly want in your life time out yep you're taking this time right now you're getting away from this person why because you have to soul search the situation you got to figure out if it's true that you want to be with this person or not and love letters expect a message from this person because they will be texting you pouring their heart out their heart out all right guys i hope this reading gave you some some clarity please don't forget to like share and subscribe click that notification bell and if you want to book a personal reading the info is in the description box below talk to you soon bye